guys, Sayangs. Welcome back to my channel today. I decided to film a hair tutorial for you guys. And I'm going to show you how to achieve this mermaid waves look. Instead of the normal spiral one, I prefer this because it's more unique. And it is perfect for a day out, for dinner. And if you're interested to find out how it's done, keep on watching. Alright, before we head on to the tutorial, a bit of context about my hair. I've been struggling with dandruff problems for the past month. You can ask my hairstylists, they would say the same thing. And I think it is stemmed from number one, sleeping late. I've been sleeping around 1 to 2 a.m. daily. That's very bad, but I can't help it. Number two, definitely stress. Because when I'm stressed, I tend to scratch my head. When I'm thinking of a solution for a problem, I tend to scratch my scalp. And that's a very, very bad habit. This is my current scalp condition right now. Look, I don't even have to zoom in to show you guys the dandruff that I have. It's really normal to have dandruff, especially if you're like sleeping late, if your scalp is too dry, if you're stressed, your diet also plays a part in it. I think my biggest problem is sleeping late. So hair care is very very important, especially if you have dandruff problems like me. I've been trying a few shampoos, tried tonics, didn't work for me until I came across Clear's Frozen Peony Anti-Dandruff Shampoo. I've been using this for the past month or so and I can definitely see the difference in my scalp. What I love about the Clear Frozen Peony Anti-Dandruff Shampoo is because it deeply cleanses my scalp and also my hair. If you guys didn't know, peony extract is very very soothing. My scalp no longer feels as itchy as it was before plus it is also infused with menthol blast whenever i apply it on my hair whenever i'm washing my hair there's this cooling sensation which is very very nice and my scalp will feel really really fresh without further ado let's move on to the tutorial now that my hair is all clean i like to apply serum while my hair is damp so that it will protect my hair from the heat that i will be putting it through I warm it up by rubbing my hands together and then I apply it all over my hair. We want to minimize the heat so I'm just using the lowest temperature setting on my hair dryer. This way may take a few minutes longer but it will protect your hair from further damage in the long run. To achieve the mermaid waves that I've showed you earlier, I'm using my favorite hair curler from GHD. First, I section my hair into two parts top and bottom and then I secure the top part with some hair clips after that I make sure that there aren't any knots or tangled hair at the bottom section by running my fingers through my hair gently I then grab one and a half inches of my bottom hair and then I start wrapping it around the wand while making sure that I'm curling the hair away from my face when I reach towards the end, I close the clamp to secure the hair in place. This technique gives you a mermaid waves effect instead of a spiral effect. For the opposite side, I simply repeat this method while making sure that the hair is wrapped around the curling iron in the opposite direction, which means it is also away from my face. It may look confusing at first, but it is actually very simple once you get the hang of it, I promise you. With the similar technique, I move on to the rest of my hair and ensuring that the sections are between 1 to 1 and a half inches. I notice consistency is best to achieve the mermaid waves look because grabbing larger sections may result in limpy curls instead and we don't want that. The curls may look very tight at the moment, but here's the best part, combing it out. You can use a brush or a white tooth comb. Here I chose the white tooth comb because it works best for me and it gives me more control of how loose I want the curls to be. The biggest and most important tip for this is to do it gently. And voila! All done! So remember, having healthy and manageable hair starts from the scalp and I encourage you guys to start taking care of it because your scalp is as important as your skin. 
And that is it. This has been my go-to hairstyle these days and I am absolutely loving it. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys found this video useful. If you've tried this look from this tutorial, don't forget to tag me. I'd love to check it out. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment in the comment section down below and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already done so. You guys are amazing. Don't ever forget that, okay? I'll see you in my next video. Bye, Sayang!